to be a fairy tale entry to his first Tour de France as Armstrong is through. And the young American, the youngest man in the race, in fact, Lance Armstrong has won his stage in the Tour de France at Verdun. And I said this could be my day. The names that we know so often, except one, Lance Armstrong of the United States, first year professional rider. Lance Armstrong, 21 years of age, is America's second only world ever road race champion. On Wednesday, October 2nd, I was diagnosed with testicular cancer. The CAT scan revealed that my condition has spread into my abdomen. For now, I must focus on my treatment. However, I want all of you to know that I intend to beat this disease. And further, I intend to ride again as a professional cyclist. I was diagnosed in 2003 with a chondrosarcoma in my jaw. I was 29 years old at the time. And the treatment for that involved removing the vast majority of my jaw and reconstructing it with a bone from my leg. Uh, following that, surgery went very well. I had five weeks of radiation treatment and was disease free and remain disease free to this day. Well, my mom was uh, first diagnosed in 2003 and I completely did not know what cancer was like at all and the first time she went in for treatment I, was, I had no clue what to expect and it was it was a scary thought so I when I came when she was telling me all this stuff I was like what because I had no clue what was going on it was a scary scary thought when I was three years old, I had a brain tumor. And when I was four years old, I had a, a second brain tumor. And when I was seven years old, I had my third brain tumor. And I'm now 18 years old. You know, when he was older, he still had cancer? How old was he? Well, and he still had cancer. I'm on my right. Tony Colick, he was in our class this year. Uh, he had cancer and he was in a wheelchair. And uh, I, I guess you could say I was friends with him, but I didn't know him for that long. So, yeah. And uh, he died from cancer during the school year and we went to his funeral. Seven years ago, I was diagnosed with the uh, same diagnosis as Lance. Uh, mine didn't come with a bike, though. Uh, uh, though I ended up with a yellow jacket by volunteering at the Cancer Society. But when we found out that he had cancer and what he'd been through, kind of like changed me, I guess. Being a cancer survivor means knowing how to use the gifts that we're given each day. Yeah, he like never gave up. You could, I, I don't think I've seen him once without a smile on his face or some sort of him being happy or up. He never really got down on himself. Never really like, I guess you could say, um, got depressed or anything. Like even with his cancer, he was always happy and he was always interested in everything. I tell them to be always be there for that person because they always need your support. Even a simple comment can always get them through, you know, something so uh, life-changing. And uh, always, always being there for them is always, always very good. It uh, really gets them through the hard times. I live strong because I've seen the strength of the human spirit, both in myself and in the stories that others have shared. And I guess that kind of changed everybody in our class. Well, what makes me uh, 
live strong is people. Uh, people I meet uh, during my volunteering, uh, either the uh, volunteers or even the people that are uh, battling the cancer. And um, when you listen to their stories and uh, listen to their courageous battles, it's inspiring. I get my strength from inside of me. I, and hugging my cat and my mom. Being a cancer survivor means knowing the strength of the human spirit. It means knowing that what Ralph Waldo Emerson said, that what lies behind us and what lies in front of us is small matters compared to what lies within us. Like even with this cancer, he was always happy and he was always interested in everything. He liked to go to school and liked to see all his friends. I am Lucas and I live strong. Hi, I'm Rob and I'm a seven year cancer survivor. I live strong. My name's Tyler and Tony makes me live strong. My name is Cody and I live strong for my brother Tony. My name's Keith, I'm 32 years old. I'm a three-year cancer survivor, and I live strong. My name is Michael, and I live strong. I'm Rachel, this is my mom. Rachel's my hero. We live strong. <laughs>